The number one question about Speed Queen is load size. Is it a queen size washer? Are you stepping down from your king size? Uh, look at this, you'll see it's about 17 inches here. This is a classic, but uh, the classic's going to have the same exact tub size as your TR series, whether it's a three, five, or a seven, they're all pretty much the same. Can your washing machine handle a queen size comforter? A Speed Queen top load washer can. Can your washing machine handle a king size comforter? A Speed Queen front load washer can. So as you can see here, not true to the center here, so we're losing an inch or two. And you can see we're 20, 21. When you measure the depth of it, you're looking at about 16. And that's hard for a lot of people to swallow. They say, will I be able to wash my comforter? Am I gonna have to go to a dreaded laundromat? Laundromats always have uh, sometimes unsavory characters and then sometimes you know who knows maybe the last person that used that washer at the laundromat uh, had a bunch of dog filth coming off blankets that now will come on yours or perhaps oil that stays in that last load that's certainly a concern you look at a newer washer a uh, king size and man you're looking you know almost 22 inches in a king size washer and you're looking at a depth of more like 20 inches. You know, this is a five cubic foot washer. No agitator, it has the impeller instead. But many people that use this style, it doesn't matter the brand, this style, often people will say that their comforter comes out or their towels come out where they're still dry on the top. It never had enough water to actually fill up compared to a Speed Queen that's gonna use 19 gallons of water. Are you stepping down in size? Most people end up making the decision and realizing that it's worth it, even with a smaller tub. Again, this is a true stainless tub. A magnet won't stick to it like it will all the other cheaply made brands. Uh, you're not gonna have it rust out on you. Also, again, they have a outer metal container for that basket, whereas everybody else is going to have a cheaply made plastic that will only breed bacteria. It's worth the sacrifice to get a Speed Queen. You're going to lose size. You just got to figure something else out. If you've got one of those super big king size comforters, what do you do? Do you go to a duvet? Do you uh, go, to, go to your friend's house and use their large king size washer? Or do you stick with a queen size Speed Queen? Size does matter.